Hi, <clears throat> this is Bill, and uh, this is a routine to change text. Um, I'll explain what it does. It's not my routine. It's um, a freely downloadable one written by a guy called Steve Doman, and along with Joe Burke uh, in 2010. So it's 12 years old, but it's still a good thing, especially when you get a drawing like this. When Here we have a drawing that's got, if we look on that text, or if I swipe that text, then it'll tell us that, well, it's Century Gothic. And over here we've got this lovely little thing with a little bracket in it, and it's the only way to change that from Century Gothic to, say, Calibri Light, is just go in there and change it individually. So there, that's all fine. Now, see, that's already Calibri Light. So, but all these other bits of text in here, they're still the old, sharp Century Gothic, which is not a bad font, but it's not what the man wants. The man wants Calibri Light. So, how to do that? After much scratching around on the internet, I found a one that does work. It's called Strip, strip M Text or something rather. Let's have a look. Um, I'll just put it on the on the screen here. So it's called Strip M Text version five C. So. That's the name of the program that I'm just about to use. To use it, you have to load it. And, of course, I recommend that you go to Tools. Uh, where's Lisp? Can't see it for looking. Tools. Auto Lisp. Okay, down to Auto Lisp. Load application. And for things that you like the look of, you just pop them in your startup suite. And sometimes you... you ditch them out of there but I've put it in there I've searched for it and added it on so it's it's ready for me to use so what I do is you select whatever it is you want well first of all make sure that your standard text see at the moment that's standard and that's if I opened up the drawing I would that would be the current one so you've got to go up to Format, Text Style, and see how it's stuck on Standard at the moment. So we want GD. So and at the moment it's Calibri. So you'd think, well, change it to Calibri Light and it'll all be fine. Close that one, do a Regen. REA, sorry, REA, Regen All. But no, that's still stubbornly staying Calibri Light. No, it's not saying it hasn't changed it at all. Uh, it has changed it. So I tell a lie there. But if you come down to here, and look at that one, now it's still stuck on Century Gothic. So you don't want that. So again, just repeating myself here a bit, I know, but you make your textile same as the one you want to be, set that current, close that one, and there's this text you want to change, right, right click, um, select similar, so all those little bits of text that you want to change, and get them to be nice and right, they're all selected, so you just go SMT, which is the list routine, and up comes this, this guy here, strip M text version 5.0C, and I've got it on remember settings, so it's remembering I like to just change the fonts. This could be handy for a lot of people sometimes use columns, and it's extremely irritating. You could probably rip out columns too if you wanted to. Anyway, so you just press OK, and the job is done. You don't have to go in there and sort that out. See how it's just gone A1, whatever that means, I don't know. Uh, but that's... Look up there, and it's Calibri Light. Job done. So it's a thing of wonder and beauty, isn't it? Okay, now I'm going to 
just close with that one. Um, and I'll put a link in the description as to where you could download this list routine. Thank you very much.